for this video I'm gonna uh, teach you how to bunny hop higher I'm not gonna make a bunny hop tutorial because there's heaps of those on the net already so just search it up on YouTube yourself and um, I'll try to teach you how to hop higher after you've learnt the basic basic motion and stuff so the best way to bunny hop higher is to actually bunny hop over stuff and onto stuff so like you, yeah you can you can like probably first thing you should do when you get the motion is to start trying to bunny hop over a line and clear it So what you can do is um, just grab a stick or something like that and put it on the floor and hop over it. So um, to know if you've got the proper bunny hop technique is just if your front wheel goes up and then your back wheel comes up afterwards. If both wheels go up at the same time, you're not bunny hopping right. I don't know what that's called. Some I don't know, people have some gay ass names for it, but yeah, I'm just going to call it the double tyre hop. So that's wrong, you got to do the front tyre first and then the back tyre. So uh, after you learn to bunny hop over a stick, you should bunny hop a curb. So pretty much to get it higher, just just work your way up slowly, like hop over small stuff and gradually build it up higher. Um, a really good thing to do is to make a bunny hop bar. Um, I, don't, I don't have one. I made one ages ago, but it broke. It wasn't like weatherproof and shit and the rain just got to it and then it, it just pretty much broke so um, you can just use whatever stuff you have like um, two crates or something and just put a stick on top of it uh, bunny hop bar is really good try to get something that, that's collapsible that can break or just fall off the bunny hop bar so you don't hurt yourself or something and so you don't damage your bike. Like, uh, watch, watch like videos. Watch, watch like the pros. Like I don't know, Gabe Brooks. Um, he kind of hucks it sideways, like he goes up in the air and he goes like that kind of thing. Um, some guys like it too. I can't in front of them. Yeah, I don't know, just watch lots of videos, see how they do it. Once you get the basic motion, um, just work on pulling up, pulling up your front end. And then after that, work on hucking your bike bending your knees and stuff like that so um your maximum height you can hop is how high you can bring your front wheel up so if you can only bring your front wheel up this that's as high as you can go you won't be able to get any higher than that if you can bring it up like bar height you have the potential to hop bar height so it's, it's mainly just how high you pull up your front end and then you gotta suck up your back end to get it over shit and stuff well, what I used to do was um, I used to just keep practicing pulling up my front end and then what I did was I uh, tried to get my bars into my lap when I pulled it up you can see like um, just watch lots of videos of people bunny hopping and stuff and just try to copy them um, also something that might help is record yourself and compare it with how someone else hops and see what you're doing wrong what they're doing and what you're doing just spot the difference pretty much so bars into your lap and then suck up your knees yeah so um pretty much you get your hops higher you have to practice um obviously when you start you're not gonna have like bar height hops or something like that 
it's gonna be super low and um you might feel yeah it might feel pretty shit but you just have to practice everyone starts at the same point every every single person who rides bmsa their hops used to be that low they, they used to hop only this high or something it just gets better over time um i've been riding for about two years i don't know how high my hop i think it's only stem height so that's that's not it's not like bar height or something it's not crazy and that's two years as well so just keep practicing hop over shit and hop onto shit and yeah i think that's pretty much it yeah um so hopefully that this video helps you um let me know if you have any troubles or something i don't know